What's going on you guys? Nick and I are going on a fishing bender for four days for striped bass because the catfish are spawning. The water temperatures are like 80 degrees. So we are going to striper fish for the rest of the weekend. Memorial Day weekend and we're gonna to try to go where there's no people or very few people because we ain't trying to play with all the boaters. We got like a three hour drive and he just ate two tornadoes from the gas station. So he's probably gonna be asking to stop here at T minus an hour, I bet. If I had eaten that, it'd be like 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, we going fishing, baby. We'll see what happens, stay tuned. Nick and I have made it to our home away from home for the weekend, and we are nothing but class here. We got the cinder block walls. <laughs> cinder block walls. A ton of rods. A bunch of delicious beef jerky. This just lit me on fire. I'm gonna regret it about 4 a.m. tomorrow morning. And the mini fridge. You know what's up. I don't know what's been done in these beds and I don't want to know, but we going on a fishing trip, baby! Oh, but wait, we forgot about the beautiful view. A McDonald's! We have a, but wait, there's more. We've got a beautiful budget-in phone. Oh yeah. If anyone wants to give us a ring. 1-800-CATCH-THESE-SKIPJACK. It's got a number on it, should I, should I give him our number? No. Uh, <laughs> Not when he's what you want to catch when you're trying to catch bait. Dang on needle nose dog. Okay. But it is cool though. Yeah. This could go horribly wrong. Okay, good. He's gone. A clean release. <laughs> <laughs> so we're skipjack fishing below the dam where there's not trout. And my buddy just caught a stalker trout. That's wild. Oh, well, we're going to get him out of there. We need to check the regulations real quick on him. Okay. Make sure he's bait size. Okay. But yeah. Heck yeah. Good morning, you guys. Nick and I have loaded up on bait. As you saw, we caught a gar, we caught a trout, we caught a bunch of skipjack. We have done a water change, and now we are gonna get to striper fishing. That's what we're doing here this weekend. We're hoping to catch some big ones, but no matter what happens, we're gonna have a good time. We're on an adventure, and we're gonna challenge ourselves, and that's what we're here to do. So what we're gonna use for tackle today and most of the trip, um, big cat fever. This is a Hellcat, medium heavy action, seven foot six. We got a Akuma Komodo 470 size reel with 65 pound test braid on it. I've got suffix 832 on this. And then we've got a quarter ounce sinker up here at the top, a little bead. And then we've got a, a double uni knot right here connecting our braid to our 50 pound monofilament leader. This is slime line, leader line. And that's about, I don't know how many feet of that it is. About six feet. Yep, something like that. We've got a big 10 knot hook at the bottom, and on the Hellcat rods, we're running the single rigs. Look, there's some skipjack busting right there. Let's see if a striper will come up on it. If a striper comes up on it, I'm grabbing this swim bait rod and jerk it, jerking over there. But um, I think that is a striper. Really? Yeah, I, I can see it from here underneath the water. Really? Yeah. Can you still see it? Uh huh. It's kind of chilling on top there. Where's that? He's swimming down this way. Point to um, me where he's at. I can't see him. 
I don't see him now, but he was literally straight in here. Was it a striper, like for sure? Yeah. Well, let's see what happens. If we could get our intro interrupted by a striper catch, that would be really cool. This is a big glide bait, you guys. So if we see him busting like that, we've got these ready that we can just throw right at him. I'm gonna do one more cast. I think he was chasing a cat or something. Well, I'm gonna have to have this thing out. Cause that, that was definitely, I saw the shad on the top. I thought it was skipjack busting, but Mr. Nick there saw a striper. Okay, well, all right. So, back to Hellcat rods have the single hook rig on them. And then, the Big Cat Beaver, these are the black ones, they're heavy action. And we're gonna put the big skipjack on these. Same type of rig, 50 pound test, but we've got a double hook rig on the bottom. So 10 knot hook, this is 65 pound test braid to a big two times strong hook, treble, bam. And that's for the big skipjack, so we don't get any short strikers. And then we've got that on a Komodo as well. So yeah, we're gonna start with some boards, and then once we get into a bigger section of the river, we'll put a float out. I don't feel like chasing the skipjack around up here right now, but yeah, we're gonna spread our baits out, and we're gonna work down the river and cover these holes and see if we can find some fish. But we may ease up here and see if we can cast over. What's on the, can you see what's on the surface up there? Is that something, I don't know. All right, we'll be back when we get something. Stay tuned, baby. We checked our officials for about 20 minutes. Nick's gonna keep throwing that red fin up front and I'm gonna start getting some live baits out. And we're gonna start pulling down the river, baby. Down the river. We didn't bring a net either, so gonna be a fun time we got that bait hooked right behind the dorsal fin right there you guys throw them out oh yeah oh yeah baby i'm excited your line's wrapped around the top you can't swim out no oh yeah so we gotta run four boards in here guys Isn't it? yeah Ten feet back behind that board. You don't want to do any more than that in here because it's not super deep. And there's trees and junk everywhere. I'm actually gonna make it a little bit shorter than that. So I can get it right up against the door. The bank. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's trying to swim right in the motor. That's what I like. them out to the bank to the depths kind of depths Let's see if we can't get them eaten y'all oh yeah that's the perfect size voyage right here with that one like that he'll swim a little bit more freely put this guy a little bit deeper because he's out in the center then we're working different depths, which is important. You got to see what depth they're at. Sometimes they want that skipjack right up close to the surface behind the board, and sometimes they want it a little deeper. 
your job to figure it out. It's my job to control this boat, which I'm not doing a good job at right now. But, all right, we're gonna get the rest of the baits out and then we'll be back with you. This board's getting chased right here, y'all. Trying to get some back out? Yep. How many feet do you leave this on this one? A little bit more. Do like three more pulls. That one just got chased. Boy, we're already having some action. So I like to see early action, baby. And I'm bringing these boards just right by those trees, as close as I can get it. Yeah, I just gotta speed us back up. One on the left getting chased too. Yeah. They know be happy. Not happy at all. Blow up right there. Blow up. Oh, I killed my bait, I think. Oh yeah, that was a blow up. That was a good one. Hundred percent. May have killed our daggum skipjack. No, they're still on it. Yeah. Playing possum. Yeah. Well, they are freaking out. Oh yeah, he's on his butt. On his butt. On his butt, on his butt, on his butt, look yep, at that, yep. on his butt. Yep, 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 yep. I mean, he's right on him. Come on, eat it. On his butt, look at that. That is super cool. I mean, he's all over that butt. Get that on video. On his butt, they're all over him. This striper was on the side of the skipjack's mouth. Over to your right, over to your right. We're gonna have to do a bunch of things at once here. This striper is on the side of the skipjack's mouth. Oh, he's right here. Can you see the striper? Yes. He's right underneath it. Oh, there's like three of them on it. There's... What the heck? He's just getting swirled by little fish. That's wild. Huh. Oh, might have some here. Yeah, we're in the money zone right now. We are in the money zone. Oh yeah, look, boil, big boil behind that bait. Big boil behind that bait. I'm gonna bring this one in. Mm -hmm.
That was cool. Yeah. There were quill back all around him. There were stripers underneath him too. Wild. Oh yeah, look, stripers blowing up back there. Stripers blowing up back there. We're gonna come down here and then we're gonna do a turn and go back upstream up against the current and we'll go real slow then. That was sweet. Yeah. You can still see them. Yeah. Oh yeah. They're down there. That's super cool. Very cool. They're at the head of the hole too. We are in the money zone. Oh yeah, look, boil, big boil behind that bait. Big boil behind that bait. I'm gonna have to bring this one in. That's a green one? Yeah, I saw the striper. Yeah, I saw the striper come out after it. Yeah, you see it behind it? Mm -hmm. Oh, did you see that? Look, he's right on it. They're going after it like crazy. This one too? Yep. Is that off? Yep. Whoa. Got him. Got him. Awesome. Got him. Oh, it came off. Damn. Damn it. Came off. Shoot. That sucks. It was a little guy. But it was a fish. Ah! Look what happened, y'all. That's why I didn't hook up. Rolled back around into the bait, the hook point. Sad day. New bait? Yeah. That's a big bust right there. Look right oh there. Goodness, stripers. 100% stripers. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Get your uh, plug ready. Look at that. Plug yeah. Look at that. They're blowing up on them, dude. Blowing up. Where's that at now? Oh, it's straight out in front of us. No.
That was nutty, bro. We got one on it, y'all. Come on, eat them. Oh, yeah, he's right on it. Look. Yep. Oh, what a blow up. What a blow up. Yeah, baby. Oh, he's right on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's right on it. That one's got one on it too, Chase. Yep, yep, it does. We got a school right here. Let's turn the motor off for a second. Hit Mark. Did you hit Mark down there? Hit Mark. He on that booty. Ooh. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Come on, eat it. Still getting chased, huh? Yeah, he's all over it. That was this one, I think. No, they're snagged. This one's snagged? It's on this green one. Oh, shit. Yeah. Just got blown up on, too. Oh, yeah. There's, a, there's definitely something on that. Yeah, my bait's getting... Oh, buddy. We got two fish chasing. Oh. That's a big guy over there. Yeah. That's a big guy over there. Oh, that's a big guy. That is a big one. Get it more. Come on, baby. Yeah, eat it. Come on, eat it. Oh, that. Might pop the board. He popped the board. I'm gonna see if he'll eat it now. I wonder if we still have bait. I don't know that I feel bait anymore. I think he got the bait. Dang. No? Y'all, I got hit bringing this in. Do. He hit this coming in. Oh gosh. I'm gonna get this out of your way. Yep. Yeah. Oh gosh. Come here. He's trying to pull. I was reeling this one in, you know. You saw it get blown up on like five times. Reeling this in, and he hit it. With the planer board on its face. Yeah, with the planer board on its face. Oh, there he pulls some drag. This one ain't huge. You want to pull this up too? No. Oh. Uh, no, just leave it. Bye. Oh gosh. Now he's wanting to fight. Woo. Towing the boat around. Move it over there to that one if you can. Yeah, thanks. Gosh, strong fish. There he is. There's some drag, there's some drag. Finally ate it. Awesome. Heck yeah. We've missed I'm gonna move all these poles. 10 fish. No, we'll just lay them straight on top of this. Look at this guys, he's got that skipjack in his mouth right there. That's cool. That's a dandy to start with. All right, Nick, you're up. Hit him in the lower jaw. Grab that leader line. 
Yeah, you don't let go later. Grab leader on. There we go. Got him. Got him. Perfect. Fat fish. Oh, yeah. Fat daddy. Yeah, Fat buddy. daddy. Heck yeah. There we go. Yes, sir. We. Oh, he's getting chased right now too. Look at this. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at this. Look at this. He's going right at it. Okay. Uh, I'll mess with that, okay. and you just watch that. All right, after literal, how many blow ups, 20 maybe? Something like that. We landed this guy. He's short and fat. I don't know what to call him, but it's a nice fish for sure. Good one of the first one of the trip. Just gordito. We're gonna see you later. We're going. See ya. Thank God we brought the beef jerky. If you want some of this stuff, there's a link in the description with a coupon code. It be delicious. And I'm about to eat this whole pack of it. Made in America. Look at that. Ooh, you want a piece? There you go, sir. Thank you. Cheers. Paid $400 to get my hummingbird fix, and this is the first time I've really used it since getting it back. And uh, it's doing that. Yep. Yep. Oh, real? Yeah, real, real, real. Get out of there. You got him? Yep. Fish on. Let me check the drag. Okay. That may end up being a big fish. He's coming upstream with it. He's going up towards that motor. He's trying to get him up. Is it broken? He just broke it. What did you do? No, he just, just came off? Yeah. I had it tight. What? Swing to miss for old Nicky boy. Never came undone. Yeah, it should have came undone. I don't know. Well, we've caught one and missed two. Or three. I can't remember. And five billion blow ups later, which has been cool to watch. He came and hit that. Another one, another one right behind the black rod. Dang. I didn't have my daggum camera going either. Well, I just got blown up on this one, yo. God, that made my heart pump. Did you see it? Yeah. I wasn't looking and it just had it stop sitting there. Freaking out now. Oh, that's on. Real. Oh, that's destroyed. Real, Nick, as fast as you can. That's a big one. Oh, God. Holy crap. That's a big one. That's a big one, dude. That was no questions asked. Destroyed. Oh, barely real with that. Oh my gosh. Nick is hooked up with a monster. He wants to cut right on the boat. Where's he going? To the right. All right, go over the top, go over the top. Go, 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 like a catfish. Go, go, boy, go. He's digging, ain't he? Go, oh, yeah. go, go. Go. Ooh. Get it out from away from the boat. Just keep it tight. Keep it bad. Make sure he doesn't get in this motor. Yeah, where's he at? Right underneath the boat. He's out, he's out from under it. Okay, we need fish grips. Where are those at? Where'd you put those? Ooh. That's a monster. Where'd you put the fish grips, Nick? I, I, I got it. Yeah, he swirled that mist and got him in the side. I got him though. First shot. Oh God. oh God, he's barely. Oh, God, 
Got him. Got him. Nice. Heck yeah. Nick got him a piggy. Let's look at that thing. Golly. Woo boy. Hold him up higher. Yes, sir. That's a good one, my boy. A good one. All right, go release her. Oh, it's a it's a boy. Is it? He likes you. Look down. You see all the white stuff? <laughs> yeah. He likes you a lot. Nice. <laughs> Big old fat male. You just push him off and he'll be good. See ya! Let's go. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so gross. But you caught a big striper. Good job. Thank you. How you feeling, Nick? I, I got the shakes. I got the shakes back. <laughs> <laughs> that one right there was something was on that one yeah look at that look at the boar going nuts look at the boar going nuts look at the boar going nuts yep. come on come on come on come on eat it 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 get it get it oh we can't walk ah the striper took us in a tree dang it Yeah, he took us in the tree. Oh, yeah. Broke it. Dang. There's a fish on this this board right here. Is that one following him? Yeah. Hundred and ten percent though. Right here. Oh, yeah. He's on it. That was a bigger fish too. Come on, eat it. Eat it. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, you want it? That was a boom. Oh, I've got a freaking dot on my screen. We're gonna come up on this over here to our right as well. Okay. Slow us down a ton. That was a good one. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, cannonball. He gotta be still behind it. Yeah. I don't know how you didn't get it. I don't know. Weird. Rolling. Oh my gosh. This is a good one. It's towing the whole boat around. Oh my gosh. I need help here. Uh, yep, what do you need? I need to go. No! Oh, did it come off? No, no, no. Take the trolling motor, mm -hmm. the remote on the, you gotta get the remote. Where, where is it? That's hooked, attached to me and yep. turn it left. Turn it left, left. going back downstream. You gotta do it now, Nick. I'm good. All right, get us going downstream and away from these trees. Oh gosh. Sorry guys, we're, uh, this is a mess. All right, let go of me for a second. Thank you. Oh, buddy. 
Oh my goodness. That is a heifer. That's a heifer. He slammed it right here at dark. Right here at dark, y'all. Holy crap. I was trying to take me in the trolling motor. I to turn the trolling motor off for a second. Yep. Here. Take me up here. Oh my god. That's a giant. Yep. Oh, he's taking more line. Taking more line. We forgot the net. Okay, you're going to have to put the camera down. Lay it. Throw a glitter line, right? Oh, no. oh god. Shit. How's this hook? Here, hold the rod and I'll do it. Look where this hook's at. The GoPro footage may have messed up. I don't know. I think my GoPro died. I don't know. Barely hooked. Barely hooked. Wow. Barely hooked, y'all. He slammed a board rod. Holy crap. We got him finally. Okay. Uh, uh, here's this fish. <laughs> She's 40 something. I don't know. My scale is the one that got yeeted in the water by the giant flathead, and I forgot to buy a new one before this trip. So even if we break the 50 pound level, I'm not gonna be able to measure it for sure and shave this mustache right now unless we can find a scale near me. But there she is, baby. That's a monster. Top Nox fishing, let's go! We gonna release her. 60 degree water. Look at that monster. That is a monster right there. Holy crap. Starting to bite me. Starting to bite me. Okay, her fins are starting to kick up a little bit. So I'm gonna push her down. I'm gonna send her back down. This is 60 degree water, 59. She's gonna be fine. We had her revive it in the bait tank for a little bit. Well, we got the hook out and everything. Got a quick picture, got a quick video. I'm gonna send her off. See you later. She go. She's biting the crap out of me. What you say, Mark? Woo! My drillings pumping, baby! Let's go! Well, good morning. It's day two of the striper fishing bender, baby. And uh, we're awake after a 14-hour fishing trip yesterday. Well, 15, something like that. It may have even been 16. I don't know. I'm still kind of loopy. Uh, it's before daylight. Um, but we had a hell of a day yesterday, let me tell you. That was a day. Caught three, lost two, had 20 blow-ups, 25 blow-ups. I mean, I got most of them on camera. Um, but, whew, whew, what a day. I'm gonna take a shower, get me some coffee. We gotta go catch some bait. Get back at it, baby. See if we can't catch another monster. And this is gonna be one big giant video all in one. I ain't gonna separate them out. We doing them all one daggum video because whatever reason, YouTube likes blowing up the big giant long ones. And I'd rather a bit edit a big giant long one and tell a huge cool story than a bunch of little ones. That's just my niche. So stay tuned, you guys. This is part two. We gonna get it, baby. So Nick oh. fished uh, 15 hours with me yesterday, 15 hours with uh, no caffeine, no energy Zero. drinks, and he usually drinks like three 300 milligram caffeine a day. And a pre-workout. So like, you're pushing over a thousand milligrams of caffeine. Oh yeah. That's not Every healthy. Day. Every day. But uh, we were all had none yesterday. Yeah. Sorry, I had, ha I had half a mellow yellow, I had 30 grams. He was juiced up on big fish adrenaline. But now... We're loaded up. Well, we had a little accident early. Um, we were going to unsnag a sabiki rig while we're catching bait, and there's a rock or a big giant concrete thing. And Nick's like, oh, should I pull the trolling motor up a little bit? I'm like, nah, it'll be fine. Well, it was not fine. 
So we're on the search for a new propeller for my Tarova. And we may have to drive an hour to go get it, but it's all right. It's cool. Back in the day, I'd freak out and be like, oh no, the whole day's ruined. Burka, burka, burka. Now I'm like, eh, whatever. Who cares? We had a good day yesterday. We're still gonna have a good day today. It's just part of it. So we had to, we got to pump the water and we got to get a new propeller, but Nick's trying to catch a bluegill by hand in the camo crocs. Nick is the fish whisperer. Oh, oh. oh I had him too, he just slipped. Almost got him. No. These are the luckiest skipjack in the world. They're getting released because we've got to go find the propeller. Come on, buddies. You are lucky. Very lucky. Yeah. Really? Ah, oh, this hurts my soul releasing these beautiful, beautiful baits. Oh. Well, here's what it is. fish behind the, the closest board to us. Yep, see that boil? I mean, he's right on him. I'm gonna slow us down. Oh, look at that fish. I could see it right right yep. on the skipjack. Following it. I can see it. Right on him. Come on, eat it. Eat it, eat it. Look, the skipjack's over here now. They're both freaking out. Oh, dang. That was a hit. He came off, though. He came off. Dang. We may not have a skipjack on that board anymore. Shoot. He's still falling, though. Yeah, he is. Trying to keep him away from this one. Oh, yep. The board didn't pop. It didn't? No. Wow. We ought to probably. I thought for sure that was a top board. Yeah. Look how the skipjack's up here. Uh huh. The real on a slap line? Yeah. Oh, look oh, at him. Oh, wow. Right on him. Slap line? Look at him. Yeah, pick that up and hold it in your hand. Turn that clicker off. I mean, he's right on him. Oh. I'm going to bring this far one in. Push button? What? Yeah, keep it open so he can eat it if he eats it. He's boiling all over it, baby. He is all over it. Oh, it's on the surface now. Yeah. I'm gonna try to bring this one in. Yep. I don't think it's gonna have a bait on it anymore. Let's mark this. That's right where they should be. This is baitless. I'm willing to absolutely guarantee it. No bait, got this one in and it is baitless. So that was 1,010% a hit. Yep, reel down on that, reel down, reel down and set. Oh, he's on, 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 on. All right, get up out of there. Yep. He going? All right, just let him go. That's a good one. Oh God. Just keep it tight. Yep. That's a big one, dude. Big one. God, we can't even stop him. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. he's there. Oh. oh, he's just way out there. All right, real quick. He's coming at us now. Yeah. Whoa. Just keep it tight. That's your job in existence is to keep that tight. Don't horse him too hard. Gosh, that's going nuts. Dude, he thumped it. He's pulling us backwards. Coming at us. Ooh. Dude, that's a good one. That's a large one. Holy crap. All right, I don't have uh, a net, so this is gonna be fun. Oh boy. Where are the fish grips at? Have you seen them? Nope. Whee! Okay, they're right here. We do have fish grips.
Dude, he thumped the crap out of that. I accidentally hit the GoPro like it was off when it was on. All right, step to the left. I'm gonna work that. Coming right out of it. Yeah. Dude, that's a toad. That's a toad, bro. Look at that thing. Dude, that thing's thick. All right, walk him to the left if you can. To the left? Yep. Like underneath these rods? Yep, if you can. Oh, he may not let you do that. Nope. All right, well, I'm gonna speed us up. Gosh, that's a heifer, bro. Okay. All right, bring him up to me. Dude, that's a monster. Bring it. I got him. Dude, that's a, that's a good one. Let's go! <laughs> High five, bro. Yes, sir. Oh, we barely got him, too. Holy crap. You want to get him? Oh. Oh, God. Grab it. Got it. Dude. 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 Yes, sir. Yes. High five. That's a good one, man. Here's uh, Nick's PB striped bass now. Holy crap. That is a monster. All right, let's release him. Yeah, baby. Face the other way? Yep. Right, Going that way. Yeah. There we go. Hell yeah, bro. Good job. Thanks. Let me see the hat. I love hot moms. <laughs> All righty. So Nick's reviving his fish, and I'm getting chased right here. Well, his fish swam off before I could videotape it, so it went that way. Good job. Nick's streak of catching big ass fish the first time he goes and does something somewhere continues. Yes. On the hot street. Some rain, some overcast, it's muggy as all get out. We call that pig fishing weather, baby. Yes, sir. Where's the sport? I can't even see it. It's right there. That one? No, that's that's mine. Over, Over there. Okay. It's way out there. So how are you feeling after that fish? Dude, I'm still shaking. Liddy. Liddy. I was like working. Let's go, baby. Let's see if I can break the mustache curse now. That thing ripped like an unholy amount of drag upstream against the current. We got a storm rolling in too. Yeah, we do. Good thing we can pull this boat to the bank if we have to. Golly, that was awesome. Have you checked the weather? Uh, before we left, not lately. Making profile picture. That's fish. Fish? Yeah, reel down. Reel, reel. Going. I can't even get out of the holder. Oh, oh god. god. Loosen that. That's a monster. Oh my god. Dead. That was a giant. That's a giant, bro. That's a giant. Just be easy on him. That's a giant. Still pulling drag. Holy crap, bro. Just ripping it right Holy now. crap. We may have to float back to him. Oh, no, 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 no. I think no, you broke it. No. Broke the stinger hook off. Broke the stinger hook off. And that was a 50 pound fish, dude. Yeah, I was, I was reeling as fast as I could. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that took 100 yards of line. 100 yards of line, easily. And that was the biggest skipjack we had. Dude. That was a monster. That was a 50 pound fish. 40 plus. 100%. Well, all we can do is bait up, y'all. But that was... Man, uh, we, I know we didn't see it, but you guys saw the one I caught last night. That was over 40. How much drag it took. What did that one just do? That was the biggest jack we had. A big giant one. What can you do, but... Put more bait out there. Lots of F-bombs were just set off camera. But, this is what it is. 
we'll get back after it, I reckon. See how it was just no hesitation, just that's what the big ones do, gone. Yep. Especially on a bait that size, that was a two and a half pound bait. May get some redemption, we got something going on over here. Wow, that hurt. Oof. The two we lost yesterday were just like 15, 20 pounders. That was a giant. Cause that drag was cranked down and it was just peeling. Get it, 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 get it. Get up out of there, fish on. Another monster. You can loosen that drag a little bit. Come okay. on. Just keep it tight, whatever you do. Yep. It's just spinning drag. I'm just gonna keep us going forward. Oh my gosh, we're hooked up again. We're hooked up again, just keep reeling. There we go. I don't like that dinging sound. Coming at us. Yep. I gotta adjust these boards over here before we lose them. That's a good one, Nick. See how it came to the surface? Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Got a good one, baby. Got a good one, baby. Good one. Nick was in shock for the last 10 minutes since that last fish. But we've got another one on here. Pulling us out a little bit. That was just out in the middle of the channel. A hard time with this one. Yeah, we've got some current going downstream and I'm just keeping us going forward. Pulling drag again. More drag? Yep. Very nice. Very nice. <sighs> just keep working them up to me. Which way does he want to go? Left. Left? Nope, nope, going right again. Real Nick. You gotta keep that tight. Oh, brother. Oh, brother, dude. I'm gonna have to slow us down just a little bit. That's a good one. Making some headway? Some. Oh, here it goes again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna float back just real slow. That means you'll have to roll a bit flat faster. If I slow my speed down, we come back. Okay. It's coming left. Okay. All right. Keep going, get over there, get over there. Real tight. tight real tight and then you go under easy easy don't do it hard like that right. everything's got to be methodical Ooh, there he is. good one bro good one good one baby Put the grips where are they oh. at where are they yeah when we went to go get a new trolling motor uh the replacement they didn't have a net at Academy. Oh gosh, he's hooked real good. Come here. Fuck. Okay. I've got him. We got him. We got him, baby. There we go. That's a little redemption. Little. That other fish you hooked was two times that size. But a fish nonetheless was caught. That one fought like that a That one tired baby. me out, dude. My yeah. hand's cramping. Woo. Yes, sir. All right, I got to let these two backboards out. That one's in the middle of the channel. I pour them cramped up on me, the one holding the rod. Yeah. You want to be a wussy some more? You want to unhook your fish? Oh, I do want to do this. Well, that's a, a good redemption fish, buddy. A good one. Heck yeah. All right, let's release him. 
Which way is facing? Uh, that way. Okay. Yep. Upstream into current. There we go, baby. That's a fish. Get it. Yep. Yep. What are you coming? I don't know. He's coming at me. All right. Yeah, that's a fish. That's a fish. Oh god. Oh god, he's still going. Oh god. Oh god. He's still going. Oh my god. I can't stop this fish. I can't stop this fish. Can you lift up that black rod for me? Yep. Gosh. All right, let me go up under you. All right, he's heading out towards back that other rod. Okay. Oh my gosh. Is he in that other line? I don't know yet. He's pulling us backwards though. I guess going forward again, or he's gonna get in everything. Mm -hmm. Big head shake. Big head shake. Big head shake. Okay. I'm gonna go underneath. This one? Yep. Yeah, do it quick, do it quick. Get back in there. Under that one. Oh god, more drag. I think he's trying to go for that, that green one. Maybe not. Uh, come on. Let that green one up. No, he's in it. It's too late. He's in it. Yep. It's okay. Is what it is now. Oh gosh, y'all. We're having a morning. Even after we broke the trolling motor, had to drive two hours out of the way. Hour and a half. Where's he at? There should only be one fan board over there. There's only one. Yeah, it's that just that one green one. Okay. Okay. Just don't touch that one for now. Yeah, just it is what it is. If you can get this one out of the way, mm -hmm. I was trying to tie a hook up on when I was so rudely interrupted by this striker. Out of the way too. Yep. This fish is about to come up. Oh, it's a horse. It's a horse. It's a horse, Nick. It's a horse, bro. Trying to go back the other way. Yeah. I'm trying to keep us out of this. You just have to grab him in the mouth. His grippers suck. Give him the gill plate. Oh my gosh, it's a horse. It's a horse, bro. Digging. I got this other board, but it is what it is, y'all. Oh my goodness. This other skipjack on the green board is just running for his life. Can't get him in. I can't get him in. More drag. Horse, bro. That's a tank. Look at them head shakes, y'all. Look at them head shakes. Holy crap. I'm gonna slow us down now. You said just grab the leader line and don't let it go? No, don't grab the leader line. Oh. Just easily grab it, actually. Okay. More drag. Holy crap. Next time, make sure I have a net. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You gotta be careful here because you got the other treble hooking. Yep. And he's got the stinger in his mouth. Oh, my back muscles are cramping. Okay. I guess you're gonna have to grab the leader, but if he tries to go, just let it go. Bye. Oh, I don't like that. Can you get the leader? Dude, that's a monster. Look how thick it is. Oh, it's barely on there. Get him now, get him now, get him now. Get him now, Nick, get him now. I'm trying, trying, trying. Get your hand in there. I'm trying, we won't open it. I got it. 
Got him. Got him. Oh. Spores belly, spores belly. Okay. All right. Monster, monster, monster. Yes, sir. Thank you, buddy. Holy crap. Ah, it's a monster. Watch how easy this hook comes out, y'all. Wow. Okay. Put him in the bait tank. It's going to take me a second to get situated. We're putting him in this super oxygenated water, y'all. He'll be chilling there. We just water changed it, put fresh salt. Got a aerator going in it. He'll be good. We'll let him recuperate for a second. Oh my goodness. All righty guys, we gonna release this piggy. Finally got all our rods unscrewed, but we got two today, lost one monster monster. This is a real good one. This is a 30 pound fish. Um, we gonna release her. Got her head going upstream in the front here. Bite the crap out of her. Love the colors on the sun there. She gone, baby. She gone. Next turn. Boy, y'all, we are having a nutso morning. We didn't even get back out here until noon after I broke the trolling motor. But we got two pigs in the boat and lost one that was gigantic. You saw how hard mine fought for it to be like a mid 30. Nick's was much, much bigger, much bigger, and it ate a bait like three times the size. We're not catching very many big skips, but the ones we have just get munched. So we're gonna keep a drag in here and see if we can't catch another pig to add to the most epic striper fishing video on YouTube ever. It's gonna watch the wa watch the rods for a second while I'm trying to tie pulling back up. Pulling up on right here. Oh, we're getting a blow up right there. Right there. Oh, boom, boom, boom. Blow up on them, blow up on them, baby. Blow up, blow up, blow up. He's freaking out. He's running for his life. He's running for his life. Da 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 Well, we'll be back if it hooks up. This one right here is running for his life now. Mm -hmm. He's like, I don't like it over here. Yeah, it's dangerous. Going real. Oh, came off, maybe just real slow. No, it's funny. Real quick, real quick. Oh, yeah, he's on. Got him. Yeah. I just put that bait out. Oh, my God. Not, not 30 seconds ago. What the heck? Wow. Bro, that just went out. All right, we got to turn the bait tank yep. pump off. Gosh, we're hooked back up. Whoa. Shh. All right, well, I'm going to get this out of the way. Yep. I put that bait out 30 seconds ago, you guys. I mean, nasty head shakes right now. 30 seconds. That's the biggest one we had left. We're gonna have to go get more bait. We're almost out. Oh, buddy. How's he feeling, Nick? Feels pretty good on man. Oh, buddy. Not as big as what I thought, but he fought like crazy. Oh well, we got a couple other ones getting chased. A couple other ones getting chased. I'm gonna speed us back up. That's a beautiful fish. 18, 19 pounds, something like that. Great, great fish. I'll pull them up. All right. How do you wanna do, you want to do this? Uh, you walk them all the way around? No, nah, we can do it right there. I am gonna use the grips on him because those hooks are about to mess me up. Yeah. All right, get up on the that okay bring him to me A double hooked in the mouth he wasn't going nowhere bring him to me bring him to me all right i got him yeah oh, now he's 20. he's probably 20 something nice wow just got me nice you good sweet yeah you good yeah baby yeah Got we got another another board going off. Another board going off. Come on, get eaten. Quit coming to the surface, you little butthole. Get eaten. Get eaten. Here, I'll even give you a little line, striper. We'll give you a little line. See, look, there he is. He's all yours. He's all yours. He's all yours. Eat him. Eat him. Eat him. Come on.
Oh, hold them up, Nick. Hold them up. Hold them up. There we go. There's Nick's he just caught. I missed one while we were trying to initially take the photo. But yeah. All right, let's put him back. That guy will swim right off. His oh, top yeah. fins are sticking straight up. Just take him off? Yeah, he'll, he's done. He's good. Let's see? Go. He found. Yes, sir. Good job, brother. What is that, number four? That's number four. All right. It's my turn, baby. We've got the boards back out with fresh skip jack, and we're doing a water change right now. We got, I don't know how many in there, 12, 13 left. Mm -hmm. We may have a couple crow kids because we put a lot in there, but we'll clean them out if not. Done. Yeah. Come on, eat him. Eat him, 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 eat him. What you got there, Nick? Number three. <laughs> I'm still one cup of coffee and some of Mel Yellow. If I had a fourth one, it would be number four. Well, I'm going to be honest, you guys. Me and Nick are dragging ass from the last two days of just going ham, 14 hours of fishing. But we have had a hell of a time. A hell of a time. And we've caught a bunch of big, giant stripers. Right now, we're getting some water on this cool river right here. We're going to go get some bait on another river down that way. And then we're going to put the boat back on the trailer and drive an hour up the interstate and go fish a river I've never been on before my life and we're gonna see if we can catch some more stripers before we head on back home to Knoxville Tennessee baby but god we've had a good trip how you feeling Nick feel pretty good letting her loose this morning oh yeah <laughs> we're pumping this super cold super cold water in the boat here so we can keep them skipjack alive god look at that big crawdad down there it looks like a lobster look at that thing I'm gonna catch him we took a momentary break in our introduction for my ADHD and this giant crawdad. He's a big boy. Look at that thing. Look at that thing. Focus. Ah! Yeah, we going bass fishing. But have you tried chicken livers for stripers? Ch chicken livers for bass. Chicken livers for bass. Yeah, baby. All right, buddy. See you later. Get on out of here. He'd be harassing our skipjack. Would he? Probably. I don't know. They'd be harassing him. He looks like a lobster. He does look like a lobster. He's big. <laughs> Nick now has learned the game, and I don't even have to tell him how to do the salt in the tank, rigging boards up. Been a quick learner this weekend. His first time ever really striper fishing hardcore. We having a blast, baby. And I'm talking a lot now because I ain't really talked a lot this whole video. It's just been a bunch of fishing. We're going to do a little B-roll filming today. Stuff like that. You know what I'm saying. Whew. Stash looking good, though. $100 right now for you to take a swig of that water. 1000 Nah, 100 Cash money. Can't do it? No shot. My bait net is falling apart. We're going to have to literally tie it together with braid to get us through the rest of the day. Well, we got to experience that beautiful drive. Let me clean my screen off here. Listen to some good tunes, and now we're in the middle of nowhere, Tennessee. Like, middle of nowhere. And we're going to drag some of these live skippies. Big boys around. Oh, we got one that's trying to croak. About to do, let's do a water change real quick. Yep. And then uh, we're gonna start pulling down this main river. We're up a creek right now. Ain't nobody here, it's awesome. Super cool. 
keep these skipjack alive when it's 80, 90 degrees out, you've got to have a lot of cold water and a lot of fresh water and salt, and you've got to change that water constantly. Putting all of it out right now, and they've kind of dirtied it a little bit in there. Um, this was crystal clear this morning uh, where we were pumping the boat up this morning, but uh, they've poopied in it and got it all nasty, so we got to change it. We drove about an hour out here where we're at, an hour and a half. I ain't got a clue if there's stripers here, hadn't had any friends fish here in a while. I've never been here, not one time. Literally looked at the map this morning while I'm drinking my cup of coffee while Nick was still asleep. And I'm like, hmm, we've had success where we're at right here. We've caught a lot of fish. Let's go somewhere near new, go exploring and see if we can catch a fish there. We've already had a successful trip. It's already gonna be a badass video. And uh, we're just gonna see if we can catch one out here. So stay tuned, come along with us on this adventure with Top Knox Fishing. We're gonna get them all perky again with this cold river water. Come on, fellers. You've got, you've got some fresh stuff coming for you. Perk back up. We need you for striper bait. We just did a 20 minute run downstream and I found a set of islands and then below that there's a bunch of creek mouths and then there's a bunch of shoals that like run out with timber and stuff on top of them that drop down into the deep water. I'm just out here sc scouting like this is an area where or a river that has stripers in it. I have never fished here and I don't know we just we just gonna see what happens but this is a good looking area it's got deep water it's got some islands and uh, I don't know it just feels stripery to me. And it's daggum beautiful, baby. Hey, Nick. It's a beautiful day, dude. Let's go catch some fish. Let's catch some fish. Okay. Baits are looking juicy. Oh yeah, baby. We got With a new, new net. A new bait net. It's really a trout net that we got, but it'll hold some skippies. It said it folds somehow, but I don't know how yet. No. Yeah. I'm trying to fold these rods on some fish. Or if you want to get them from a long ways away. You can. Extendo Skippy. <laughs> Skipjack in the water. Freshies. Looking good. Double hook rigged all of them. So we don't get no short strikers. We got an island. Let's see if there's a striper. We got us a creek mouth coming in right here. We got like 0.2 to 0.3 mile an hour current. And we going a mile, mile, mile and a quarter, somewhere in there. If I get fish swirling, I'll slow it down a little bit, let them eat it. If they won't eat it that way, they won't speed it up and see if they'll just slam it instead of fooling with it. Kind of got to experiment. Well, we're winding and retreating here right now, getting down to another area that we wanted to fish. It's like a stump field, it looks like. Rocky Island thing, I don't know, we ain't down there yet. It just looked cool on the map. We pulled for about, I don't know, a mile and a half now. And he's throwing a red fin and I'm throwing a glide bait. And then we're pulling four skipjack behind us down this river. It's a cool river. It's like 65 degrees right here, and it's 85 like today. So water be cold, baby, cold, cold. Everywhere else, the water temps are like 82, 83 on main lakes. So. This where the strippers like to be, the cold water, except this river is like 200 miles long, so ain't got a daggum clue if they in this section. They could be 100 miles upstream. I don't know. We're just exploring. We had a good day, two days in a row, caught six, seven giant stripers, so now it's time to put our, our bucket time in and go explore. Some more. Cause that's what I really find fun. I love catching the big fish, but I love going to a new place I've never been before, working real hard and then catching a the biggin. That's my favorite. But it's been beautiful out here. We haven't seen another person in the whole time we've been down here. We ran 10 miles downstream and we pulled a mile and a half. Ooh, we got a backlash, it's all right. You can, it's easy to do that on red fins. 
Um, but yeah. Yeah, just gotta make sure you get it before those boards get to it. Yep. Which is, yep. You just hold it here? Yep. Oh, by the skin of your teeth. Got it. But yeah, we've seen more cows than people. We've actually seen no people and like 100 cows. And that's it. Two houses, two or three, and 12 miles of river. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Got a big creek mouth right here. There's bait everywhere. We saw skipjack or white bass chasing stuff. We got whatever this is out here, a big, like, island. Look, there's gizzard shad jumping. I ain't got a clue where we're at. <laughs> I mean, if that doesn't look stripery, I don't know what does. I mean, there's down logs everywhere. All right, well, the fishing trip's done. We didn't catch anything on the final day but a sunburn, and we just ate an ungodly amount of food, and we're exhausted. We're so tired. We put all the rods in the trucks so they didn't get stolen, and... Uh, we're too tired to take them out of the truck. So Nick's sitting like this. Gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. So thanks for coming along with us on this striper fishing adventure. Uh, yeah. So I'm tired. Hit that like and subscribe button. Yeah. We'll see you.